program, offline program, a turbine in an afternoon rather than multiple days, that turnaround time comes down. We've only just paused production for five minutes uh, because Simon's been very kind enough to let us have a look at the first ever five axis machine that you brought on site here at FGP. How long, how long ago was it? This one was brought in over 20 years ago now. 20 years ago they've been doing five axis here at FGP. But Simon, um, who are FGP? FGP are our subcontractor down here on the south coast of Dorset. Yep. Absolutely, and you guys do have loads of really interesting components. What do you make? So we do prismatic parts for the aerospace industry, valve bodies, actuation parts, um, servicing uh, planes or um, helicopters. Perfect. These go, these go in like huge um, like flight, uh, planes that you'll be going in if you're going on holiday. You might be flying in a parts with some parts that are made by FP, FGP. Exactly that. We, we provide the piece parts that go into a high level assembly. Yeah. And helicopters as well. I mean, it's, this yeah. is amazing parts around here. We can't show you many of them, unfortunately, because there's NDAs, as you can imagine. Um, but you uh, do a lot of different other processes as well here, as well as machining, don't you? So yeah, we, we would do pressure tests, shot peen, anything you can think of to finish that part, we do with Insight to supply that as a finished part to the customer. Wet paint, surface treatments, we do it within group. Let's talk more about five axis machining. Now, it seems to be kind of the backbone of the business now, um, as well as kind of three axis machining as well. Why did you get into five axis machining? Well, if we look back, over 20 years ago, we had to stay competitive. And to do that, the, the, the buzzword back then was five axis machining. So we, we knew that was the future. So we took the decision to get our first five axis machine, which was this machine here. Um, so yeah, we can, our parts are, as I say, five axis, uh, five sided prismatic parts. To hit all five sides at once, we took the decision to go with five axis machining. And why do you need to provide that complete service? What do your customers demand of you? You use the word one-stop shop. A customer can come to us and we can supply their finished part so they can go straight into their, their high level assembly with that finished part. There's no lead plugs, wire inserts, treatments needed. We supply that as shipped to customer. And they're really complex components. They're really intricate um, and quite fascinating. Now, but it's not just five-sided five parts as well. I mean, there's uh, there's turbine blades as well that have been thrown into the mix more recently than 20 years ago. Yeah, I mean, the, the turbines came along probably 10 years later, so looking back 10 years, we, we do a lot of turbines for our customers uh, of various shapes, different sizes. Yeah. But you can't just buy a, a five axis machine, plunk it on the shop floor, and expect to be making good parts as soon as it's running. Um, you need a lot of other things to support that five axis machine, don't you? Indeed we do. To support this, this, this investment, new investment back 20 years ago, we needed a, a CAM package to support that. And our, our CAM package that we chose at that time was MasterCAM. And what's hard about making those turbines? It's, it's the, uh, the programming side of that. The, uh, a, a turbine, depending on its complexity, you've got a main blade, splitter blade, multiple splitter blades. It's the time taken to program, safely program with repeatable machining strategies. And you've been using them now, obviously, for 22 years. Why did you choose Mastercam at the start? And, and why have you continued to stay with them for such a long time? We did our due diligence, went through the, a number of uh, CAM providers, but uh, Mastercam um, were offering that full support, that full simultaneous machining. We took the plunge from the get-go to do full simultaneous machining. Mastercam could support with that, with the post processes to back that up, that support that they gave us. And it must be quite scary taking on a new machine and a new piece of software at the same time, doing completely new components that you might not, um, you might not have accepted before from customers. How did that make the process a little bit easier? It was, it was, it was seamless at the time. It, we didn't really think about it. Um, the um, support from the machine tool provider and Mastercam seemed to work very well, very well and has grown with us as we've added to that portfolio of machines through the number of years. Absolutely, you've grown so much. How, I mean, what's, what's happened to the shop floor? We've got so many different machines around us. So going from one five axis to 15, where we are today, 15 five axis machines, with a total of 63 NC CNC machines across two sites, it's grown considerably in those years. And it's not just new machines you've been taking on and new technologies, it's also new kinds of components too. Yeah, so if we look back 10 years ago, a customer came to us um, with the need to machine uh, turbines, so a big tur turbine package all different varying shapes and sizes, scroll turbines, axial fans, um, which we then got into. So, majority of those turbines at the time were cast. A 
and we're very keen to go to a billet solution, a make from solid solution, which makes it a lot easier for us to start that process. And the yield from the uh, raw material, castings notoriously bad for their yield, we go to a billet form, a lot easier for us to start work on that immediately to get a better yield and reduce the cycle times. And you, it's, it's fascinating, you test these on site, you spin them up to a, a crazy RPM. Yeah, we have full test facilities uh, on site here. Um, we te over, over speed these to over 100,000 RPM to destruction test these things. And in order for those parts to perform, they need to be machined correctly. Yeah, to um, get these, these, these turbines up to speed, they have to be balanced within micrograms. Um, and again, if you look at a cast version, very difficult and uh, time consuming to balance. You go to a machine from solid version, a lot easier to balance because the center of mass is much better controlled. And I, I guess presumably the, the thing that dictates the quality in that part is the, is the cam tool pack. Indeed, the machining strategies that we use on our cam package, we can, once we've solved um, a solution for machining a, 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 um, a titanium turbine or an aluminium turbine, that then goes across to the next turbine. We can employ that across multiple turbines. Absolutely. So you choose which kind of strategies you want to choose as a business to yep. make sure you get the right turbines for your customers. Indeed, yeah. And uh, like, the quality is key. It's a cornerstone of FGP, ensuring that, that that turbine will perform for evermore. And what does Blade Expert do for the programming time of the, these turbines? So since we've uh, onboarded Blade Expert through Mastercam, Dan has taken our processing time or the, um, the uh, offline programming time down from multiple days even to weeks for a complex multi-splitter turbine down to an afternoon's work. It is that simple to use. And what does that mean for the business as a whole, knowing that you can program these really complex components quite quickly? It's turnaround time. Customers are always, always demanding shorter and shorter lead times. If we can program, offline program a turbine in an afternoon rather than multiple days, that turnaround time comes down. So it's complex components that are manufactured, programmed quickly, manufactured to a good quality from Mastercam, here at FGP.